This is 27-year-old Mrs. Oguchuku from Imo State, Nigeria. She has come to the Synagogue Church of All Nations with the problem of a leg ulcer. This is the leg which has been affected by the ulcer, and as the camera pans down, you can see the area on the leg where the terrible leg ulcer is located. Zooming in to the open wound, you can see just how appalling this problem really is. The ulcer has severely eaten away at the flesh. The raw pussy tissue is throbbing with pain and the skin surrounding the ulcer is dead. Put yourself in Mrs. Okuchuku's position. The excruciating pain, the limitation of movements, the social stigma that accompanies such a disease. This problem has become a curse. And who can remove the curse? It is none other than Jesus Christ. She has been to several hospitals and other places in search of a solution to this problem, but found nothing. She has finally decided to go to someone smarter, wiser and stronger than herself. Jesus Christ who raises the dead is her choice. Let's listen to Mrs. Ogochuka's experience with this disease. Our sister, welcome you to the Synagogue Church of All Nations today in Jesus' name. You are right, thank you. Can you tell us your name and your age? My name is Ogochuku Inyanacho. I'm 27 years old. Can you tell us what is the problem that brought you here today? I have leg, uh, leg ulcer. I can't walk properly. I feel pain all over the leg. I went to several hospitals, more than five places, before I came here. And there was no solution. And today you're here at the Synagogue Church of All Nations. What is your belief in God? I believe that God Almighty will heal me. I'll pray with you that the Lord Jesus will set you free today in Jesus' name. Amen. Mrs. Okuchuku has clearly suffered a great deal as a result of this awful affliction of a leg ulcer. The problem has affected her ability to walk and has caused her much pain. Every day has been a struggle, a battle to survive the ordeal. Satan's sicknesses are thieves of joy, effort, time and money. In the world there is trouble at large, but Jesus Christ encourages us in John 14, not to be agitated, stressed out or thrown into confusion as a result of our situation. For though there is reason to be troubled, there is a greater reason not to be. Mrs. Oguchuku has come to the Synagogue Church of All Nations with the hope that Jesus Christ will restore her stolen joy. Mrs. Oguchuku is placed at the prayer line of the Synagogue Church of All Nations, waiting in faith for her encounter with Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. La de la de de Dieu. Prophet T.B. Joshua ministers prayer in the power of the Holy Spirit, and the authority in the name of Jesus Christ instantly removes the curse that is behind her problem. Her leg moves in response to the Spirit-filled prayer. C'est une plaie extrêmement payante, mais Jésus-Christ est la réponse à tous les problèmes fondamentaux de la vie. Mrs. Okuchuku stands on her feet after Prophet T.B. Joshua declares her free in the name of Jesus Christ. When Jesus Christ sets you free, you are free indeed. Mrs. Okuchuku came back to the Synagogue Church of All Nations some time later with a different story to tell. Looking at her expression and body language, it's hard to tell what the story is. But recall when Mrs. Okuchuku first came to the Synagogue Church of All Nations. What we saw was a large gaping wound of a ghastly leg ulcer. What do you expect to see? Wow! There are no natural words to describe it, except to say, Thank you, Jesus Christ! Just in case you were wondering, yes, it is the same leg and area where the leg ulcer was once located. The wound has totally closed up. The once around in dead skin is now new. The leg is completely healed, and all that remains is a scar that serves as evidence that she once had a leg ulcer. Jesus Christ has restored her stolen joy and restored her back to the original position in which she was created. Everything that had died in her life, including the dead skin surrounding the leg ulcer, has been resurrected. As she looked up into the face of Jesus and whispered her request, her request was granted, because it is her Father who is on the throne, and it is Jesus the Lord who is by his side. 
she taps her leg on the area of the scar to prove to the world that Jesus, the Son of the living God, still heals all manner of sicknesses and diseases. No more pain, no more leg ulcer. Jesus Christ has taken over her problem and given her joy. Hallelujah! Praise the Lord! Emmanuel! My name is Mrs. Ogechuku Nyanacho. The problem that brought me here to the Synagogue Church of All Nations is leg ulcer. When I had this problem, I can't move. I can't do anything on my own. I went to several hospitals for healing. No way. Even the last hospital I went, the doctor told me that he would cut off my leg. Till somebody brought me here to the Synagogue Church of All Nations. Immediately the man of God prayed for me. I received my healing instantly. I started walking immediately after the prayers. As you can see now, I can walk, I can do everything, I can jump. Praise the Lord. She taps and presses her leg, something that she was unable to do when she had the problem of a leg ulcer. I'm feeling fine. I'm okay. Thanks be to Jesus. She is free indeed. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm okay. 